A beating tray with a stick is useful for monitoring a large area of insects in a short amount of time. To build the frame, you'll first cut four segments of the window screen framing into about 18 inch lengths. And you can use a hacksaw to cut all the pieces. And next you will drill a hole through two of the segments on opposite sides about nine inches down. And that will be used to secure the handle. So next you can put the frame together using the window frame corners to make a square. Cut your fabric so it's about one inch wider and longer than the size of the window frame. Next, cut four pieces of spline a little longer than 19 inch lengths. So lay the spline pieces you cut into the groove along the window frame to attach the fabric to the frame. And for this part, you can either use the back of a pair of scissors or you can use a rolling spline tool. Once you've reached the end of the frame, just cut off the excess spline with a pair of scissors. The finished product should be nice and tight on all sides. So the half inch metal piping is gonna be used as the handle for the beading tray. So it should be cut into about a three foot length with a hacksaw and then using a drill, drill two holes through the pipe. And the first one about a half inch from the top of the pipe, the other one about 18 inches down. The idea is to drill the holes in the exact same location lined up with the pre-drilled holes in the window frame. Use the nuts and bolts to secure the handle to the frame on either end. You may need to use a washer to get a nice secure fit. The last step is to make a padded stick that can be used to tap branches without harming the bark. So just wrap a cloth around an old broom handle and then secure it with duct tape. And there you have your beading tray and stick.